Cisco certified network associate welcome back everybody i am am khan your trainer for entire series today we would be learning about tia and eia 568 and tia eia 568b standards so this video is not only for the people who are going for ccna certification but anybody who is interested to or looking to start a career in networking watch this because you are going to learn a lot ccna certification is very valuable certification i urge everybody to go ahead and take the certification because it is going to add lot of value so what do you mean by tia eia so tia is telecommunication industry association and eia is electronic industries alliance so let us discuss about this both there are two major unshielded twisted pair cable wiring standards used widely in networking industry telecommunication industry association that is tia and electronic industries alliance that is eia developed the tia slash eia 568a and tia slash eia 568b standard for unshielded twist, twisted pair wiring so tia slash eia 568a and tia slash eia 568b standards determine the order of the wires placed in the rj45 connector functionally there is no difference between tia slash eia 568a and tia slash eia 568b standards only the difference is that the position of green and orange wires are switched so how it is compared tia slash eia 568a wiring so number 1 the first wire which is green and white the second wire is green the third wire is orange and white fourth wire it's blue fifth wire it's blue and white sixth wire it's orange seventh wire it's brown and white and eighth wire is brown so these wires are compared according to their colors so this tia and eia 568 b wiring which includes the first wire it's orange and white where we have read in 568a that is green and white in the first in this is orange and white in color so second it's orange third it's green and white fourth wire it's blue fifth wire it's blue and white sixth wire it's green seventh wire it's brown and white eighth wire it's brown so you can follow any standard if a specific standard is mentioned in the network installation project documents just follow that if you determine i'm sorry it's if you terminate the rj45 jacks at both ends of a patch cable with same standard either tia/eia568a on both sides or tia/eia568b on both sides you will get a straight through cable if you terminate rj45 jacks at both ends with different tia/eia568 standards one side tia and eia 568a and other sides tia and eia 568b you will get a crossover cable view and subscribe my channel network group